Hey guys, Michael Gibbons here. Uh, today we're going to talk about scales. Um, the items you'll need is a guitar and um, some way to hear the guitar, probably through an amplifier. There are all different kinds of scales. There's blue scales, there's um, major scales, there's all sorts of kind of scales. Scales can be helpful, so to get some agility underneath your fingers. Um, scales can also be helpful when, when um, forming solos and, and uh, forming guitar parts. However, I would say when you are soloing, think more melodies than, than you do scales. The melodies are what are important. The scales are just to help you get to those melodies. Um, let's just quickly go through a major scale and we'll go through a blue scale and be done. I will do a major scale in the key of G. One thing that's been helpful to me is to think of my fingers as they own a fret completely. So all the strings that belong to that fret, they own. So my first finger in, in the key of G, my first finger, pretend that it owns all the strings in this fret, within this fret. Second finger on the third fret, we're going to pretend that my, that finger owns all those strings, and so forth with the third and fourth finger. So starting on G, Let's also look at a blues scale. The blues scale we will also do in the key of G. Now, if I can tell you just the numbers, as if this finger was one, two, three, and four, we'll go like that. One, four, one, two, three, one, three, one, three, four, one, four, one. Four, one, four, one, four, three, one, three, one, three, two, one, four, one. That's a blue scale.